Presentations let you compile ePortfolio items into a web project to showcase your achievements. Your achievements can have multiple pages and use different themes and layouts. Presentations provide a polished professional medium to demonstrate your learning and accomplishments. So this is a series of tutorials on how to create a presentation. You should have already created the presentation, decided on a layout, and created a banner. Now your next step is to choosing uh, and editing a theme. The themes allow you to add your own images, colors, and borders to your presentation to make it your own. So you should already be in your presentation if you click on the theme tab on the nav bar. And if you're not in there, if you already closed your presentation, you can click on the context menu next to it and edit it. You're going to get to see a page of uh, a list of all available themes. The current theme is the one that's showing at the top. Now you can also show the, change the numbers here because I think by default it's showing 20 but you may want to change and show all of the themes so you don't have to scroll through the different pages. So as you scroll through the themes you can see each one here and then if you can click on the little uh, preview icon this will give you an idea of what the theme looks like and whether it's something you really want. If it's not, you can go ahead and keep scrolling through and then clicking on the preview icon and choosing a different theme until you get to the theme you want. Once you've chosen that's the theme you want, click on the select button and then click the set theme. So now this is the theme that you've chosen, but now you can actually edit that theme. Um, and you should note that you'll want to make sure you click the save before you do any editing here. So to edit the theme and to customize it you want to click on this little icon that's the edit theme icon. Now the edit theme icon is going to come up and you'll be taken to the edit theme area. Now there are many areas uh, of the presentation theme that you can customize as you can see a lot of different areas and then as you scroll through the area, you're going to notice the blue part. So this little blue part here within the image is going to show you which area is effective. So you can also click on this filter area. And if you want to look at the banners and filter by a specific area and what things you can change, you can choose that in the drop down and then click apply. Each area will have different things that you can customize. So let's do, let's take an example. If you wish to change the color, uh, page background color, uh, make sure it's selected. So the page background is selected here. And you'll notice that on this, you can change, uh, you can add a file, you can change the position of the image, change the background color, put the borders and all that. We're going to click on the background color um, tile and we're going to change it to a different color. Then you're going to click Save. And this is going to take you back to the theme area. Now you really can't see what you've done there. So if you want to click on the little preview icon to be able to preview the theme, you'll see there's the green background color that you changed. If you don't like that, you go ahead and click on the Edit and what you can actually do is click on this restore icon below the preview area so that you can actually restore it to the way it was and then if you want to change it again. So you repeat this process for all the different areas of the themes so that you can actually um, make this theme your own and change it to whatever way you want.